Gray catbirds are part of the genus Dumatella, which means small thicket where they are often found. For all seasons, they live in dense shrubs, vine tangles, and young tree thickets, seemingly secretive, including while feeding and tending young. In the winter, they spend more time in the tropical forest, though. They are long and slender like the mockingbird, but smaller with a gray body and black cap and rusty patch under the tail. The tail is long and rounded and is held higher than the body. Their diet is ants, beetles, grasshoppers, caterpillars, and moths until the fruit ripens. They will eat holly berries, elderberries, poison ivy, greenbriar, bay, and blackberries when they are available. The name catbird comes from the fact that they make a mewing sound like a cat or a kitten. Being a curious bird, an imitation of this call can make the catbird appear to get a good look at who's making it. They are of the same family as mockingbirds and thrashers and so will also mimic other birds and make up their own song using a combination of those notes interspersed with chatter. Unlike the mockingbird and thrasher, they do not repeat notes. They can sing their long song for as long as 10 minutes. They will stop singing when approached and start the mewing call. The song is loud when the male wants to establish a territory, but is softer when near the nest or someone intrudes on his territory. The female sometimes sings softly back to the male. They are quite territorial, chasing away not only members of their own species, but also several other species. They even defend their territory during the winter, unlike most other species. When a quarrel erupts, they may fluff up the breast and rump feathers, spread their tail, and open their bill to the sky. Usually their nests are on branches hidden in dense shrubbery about four feet off the ground, but it can be much higher or lower. The nest is built by the female with a little help from the male who usually supplies the material. She makes an open cup of twigs, straw, bark and mud, then lines it with grass, hair, rootlets, and pine needles. It's usually five and a half inches wide and two inches deep. She then lays one to six turquoise green eggs and incubates them for 12 to 15 days. After hatching, they remain in the nest for 10 to 11 days and are fed insects. The catbird will sometimes destroy eggs and nestlings of the eastern wood peewee, chipping sparrow, and song sparrow. <laughs>